Hey guys, it's me, Kat, and it's Wednesday, May 23rd, 2018, although technically it's Thursday already because it's after 12 a.m., so that means it's technically almost Fanime, day zero. As you all know, I go to day zero every year through Monday, and I'm excited, and I've got almost everything packed and ready to go. In my last video, as you noticed, I mentioned that I had one cosplay I wasn't sure about, I did make that vlog a few weeks ago, but finally uploaded it yesterday because I've just partly been busy with stuff, but also it kind of slipped my mind and I forgot to upload it until yesterday, and I apologize for being so late on that, but I finally got it up, so go check that out. And in it, I mentioned that I was unsure about a cosplay, but of course I have it finalized and, and I decided to do that cosplay. So, everything else is the same. My lineup's the same, as I mentioned in my previous vlog. Tomorrow, tomorrow I'm wearing Kyrie in the school uniform. Friday, I'm doing Makoto from Free, and I'm hosting the Free Gathering at 5 p.m. And then I'm doing Ed from Cowboy Bebop for the old school gathering and the rest of the day. Saturday, I'm doing Kyrie again for the Kingdom Hearts gathering. And then after that, I'm doing Ed again just because... Sunday, I'm doing Shoda from Idolmaster for the Idolmaster Gathering, and then after that is the cosplay I have yet to mention, and that is Uriyu Ishida from Bleach, and I'm doing the school uniform version because I'm already bringing the pants and the shirt, so I might as well just do that cosplay, and I had a blue tie, I just had to paint the yellow stripes on it, and then I was good to go. And I had the wig and glasses, so I decided to add him to my lineup because I've been binging Bleach on Netflix, kind of, and I am sad I didn't get into it a long time ago. I wanted to watch Bleach for a long time, but I guess the fact that it's a long anime kind of threw me off back then, but now, like, I wanted to check it out finally because it's been so many years and I thought, well, I'll finally start watching it and because I've been wanting to for a long time. I just, I never really got around to it, like, years ago. And I'm kind of sad, because I remember, like, at every con, I would see a ton of Bleach cosplayers. And I loved seeing them and everything, and just, I don't know why I never really wanted to watch it back then. I guess because we didn't really have streaming or anything like that, so maybe that's why I never watched it back then. But now, it's like, you know, it's right there where I can watch it, because... You know, it's easier to binge watch it now. So I guess that's why I'm finally getting into it, because now it's easier to just watch all the episodes. So, And yes, Uriyu is my favorite character, because I relate a lot to him. Okay, first of all, he sews and everything. And of course, you guys know I sew and everything. And he's also a Quincy, which means he uses a bow and arrows. And recently, I've shown interest into archery, thanks to Merida and Brave and everything. That movie, you know, made me show interest in archery, and so that's also a plus with Uriyu. Another thing is we're both left-handed, which I also love, and also the fact that he was close with his grandfather. I was kind of close with my grandmother because her and I both were heavily into sewing and making stuff. So he was close with his grandfather because they were both Quincy's and everything, and his grandfather was his sensei, and he lost his grandfather, and I lost my grandmother, so that kind of, I made kind of the connection there. So I do feel like I have a deep connection with Uriyu, so of course he's my favorite character. I do also love Ichigo, and I love the pairing of Uriyu and Ichigo. You all can hate me, I don't care. And I do also love Orihime, and I do kind of like Rukia. I thought I would like her more, but I think she's alright. I don't know. I think I like Orihime, because she's more cheerful and everything, and she's cute. And I do kind of want to cosplay her too, eventually. Which, I can do that easily in the uniform. And hopefully next year, I hope to have Uryu's Quincy outfit for next year's fanime. Anyways, back to this year's fanime. Everything is just about ready, and I'm just about ready to go. Oh, and then after Uriyu on Sunday, I'm doing Mink for the panel, and just with my group. And then Monday, I'm going to be wearing Uriyu again. I know I said I was just going to wear him Monday, or I was going to wear whatever cosplay on Monday, but there's a Shonen Jump gathering on Sunday that I decided to go to because I really have nothing else to do at that time. 
the Idle Master Gathering on that day is around, I think it's at um, 1 o'clock. So after that, I'll probably wear Shoda for a couple more hours and then just do Uryu. And that's going to be real quick. Then I'll go from Uryu to Mink. So I am excited for this year's anime and I'm excited for just everything. I mean, everything con-wise. So yeah, and I hope to see you guys there, those of you that are going. Those of you who aren't, I will have pictures and videos in slideshow format for you guys after the con, just like the last couple years. So look forward to that again this year. And yeah, so my suitcase is over here, as you can see. It's all packed. Well, it's mostly all packed. And then I have a bag of stuff there. And then I have my Somako Ita bag right here that I'm bringing with me when I'm Makoto. And yeah. And my mean Gwen's over here that I'm bringing as well. So yeah, those are the Ida bags I'm bringing. And I hope to find stuff for my Uryu one that I plan to work on. I'm going to be using the bag that I was using for Chuya. I'm going to use that one for Uryu because I don't really plan to get more Chuya stuff for that anytime soon. So I'm just going to use that bag for Uryu for now. So... I do still love Chuya, but not as much as I used to. I don't know. But I'm sorry to everyone who that disappoints, whatever. But I do still love him, though, so don't worry. So anyways, I hope to see you guys. Okay, so I'm done here, and I have things I have to finish up and get... I have to finish packing and everything, but I'm mostly ready, so I'm super hyped and everything. So, bye, guys!